hello and welcome to my channel so today in this video we are going to learn about uh, integrating blender gis plugin in uh, blender so you might have seen a lot of maps uh, around social medias uh, that uses 3d visualization using ilsaid or many other uh, application from uh, blender so uh, in this video we'll learn uh, something similar to that but uh, it's uh, not about complete but we will use a simple plugin in uh, blender uh, that's called blender gis and uh, we'll integrate uh, geographic data into the blender environment so it might be google uh, maps or uh, open street map uh, uh, data uh, and uh, try to uh, create a 3d visualization of the data from open street map as well so let's get uh, into this video so I have this uh, blender uh, uh, installed on my uh, laptop so if you haven't already installed the blender on your laptop so I'll give the link in the description so you can go to that and uh, download and after that so when you uh, have this so let's uh, search about blender cis login and in github you can find blender gis plugin here so i'll also keep this link in the description and after that you can directly download zip file from here so from code you can download directly zip file so i have already downloaded it so let's again <coughs> download it in desktop so and then you start download so it's a pretty small file so it won't take any time for the downloading and after you have downloaded the plugin you can go to blender and uh, in the edit option you can see the preferences so you can go to preferences and in preferences you can see add on option so click on add on option and i have already added the blender gis plugin so you can see the blender gis it's ticked here in 3d view blender so if you haven't uh, so uh, if you are using it for the first time you can go to install and then you you can go to the directory where you have downloaded the plugin the zip file so i have it in desktop sorry okay so and here is the blender gis master zip and you can click on install add-on and after you have added it you will see this blender gis here ticked in this and you can close this window so after you have uh, installed the blender gis plugin in blender so you can see this option as gis here in uh, your interface and when you click on this you can see various option so web geo data you can add a base map or open street map data or elevation data from srtm and or or you can import a save file geo reference raster file as well or open street map data or any other and you can also uh, have various option here in this uh, plugin so let's go with the base map so, and we'll use uh, at present the google base map and layer will be the satellite and okay we can click on this so after this you can see when you zoom in so this hairline it's the uh, center of the map or the area of interest your area of interest so what we can do is we can uh, click g on the keyboard and you can uh, increase your zoom level directly by sliding this or you can go to their your place area of interest so i'll search Kathmandu, and i'll can enter as okay so this is my zoom label or also you can you can change the zoom label okay let's go with 10 okay sorry so okay uh, it's taking a bit time to render so let's go with this place in Kathmandu okay let's do this so uh, let's take a small area for this so that it won't take a long time to download the data later the OSM data later uh, when we uh, render it it might take a lot of time so it will take a small area after that you can 
press E key on the keyboard so that you can export the data or export into the area of interest and it will only cover the area that you have choosed so what we will do is we'll go to GIS plugin again and go to webs uh, web geo data and click on get OSM data so after this you can see what type of uh, feature are available on this from node or ways or relation so we'll select a building and highway land use and natural so we don't have a railway waterway wheel and laser and you can also select the elevation from the object so you can directly uh add the elevation from uh, open street map so if the, the open street map data has height uh, value uh, you will directly get that from the object or you can also uh, add the default uh, uh, height value as 20 or you can increase or decrease and uh, uh, it's for the default uh, a feature that do not have height value in open street app so let's click on okay sorry oh it took node day value so let's delete this first so we want width So when you click on ways, it will uh, bring the uh, boundary data <coughs> or the connection of uh, nodes. So you can see uh, a great 3D data. And after that, what we can do is we can click on this viewport. Sorry. can uh, click on okay you can uh, work on any type this is x-ray this is outline old billboard and many thing texture or also can do flat m m m mat cap you can choose <coughs> any theme so that it looks more realistic okay so this looks a bit more better so this way you can add 3d buildings in blender i hope uh, you liked uh, this video and if you think this video is useful you can share it with others as well and thank you very much for watching